Today we're looking at the difference between a physio, EP or PT, being exercise physiologist or personal trainer, and which ones you could or should be using. Welcome to Parkinson's Wellness. My name is Alison and I'm an exercise physiologist with Parkinson's New South Wales. Let's begin by briefly going over what each of these allied health professionals do. Physiotherapists are specialists in the human body and how it moves. They're involved in the assessment, diagnosis, planning and management of patient care in their bodies and work with people of all ages. They help patients with chronic disease manage and provide lifestyle modifications, self-management advice, prescribe assisted aids and appliances, prescribe and supervise exercise for patients and provide health education, occupational health assessments, injury, injury prevention activities, so many things they do. Physiotherapists work in a variety of settings as well. They're in private practice, they're in hospitals, community health centres, residential aged care facilities and sports organisations. Some of the most common conditions someone would see a physio for are diabetes, osteoarthritis, osteoporosis, stroke, chronic illness such as Parkinson's or multiple sclerosis, some injuries or pain management or surgery um, type of rehabilitation. To work as a physio, you have to complete at least a five to seven year degree, so going towards a master's degree, and complete supervised practice in a clinical setting. Physios are required by law to be registered under the, nat the National Physiotherapy Board of Australia and are recognised with Medicare and private health insurances for rebates. <clears throat> Exercise physiologists or EPs are slightly different. They specialise in clinical exercise for a range of health issues. They aim to prevent or to manage acute or chronic illness and disease post-diagnosis, so they don't do any of the diagnosing. Um, they look at these exercises and they use them to restore physical function, health and wellness with exercise bases for their interventions. Um, they have, give physical education, advice, support and lifestyle and behavioural changes. Their services include physical assessments, exercise prescription, incidental activity on how to incorporate in your life and support against other sedentary behaviours people go through. You can benefit by consulting an accredited exercise physiologist or EP for chronic disease management after diagnosis for a range of conditions, particularly Parkinson's, of course, MS, other neurological cardiovascular disease, metabolic problems, arthritis, osteoporosis, um, musculoskeletal issues, and along with things like depression and anxiety as well. To work as an exercise physiologist, you must complete at least a bachelor degree and maintain your continuing education points every year and be registered with an organisation, ESSA, Exercise Sports Scientists Australia. They're recognised by Medicare and private health insurance as well for rebates. <clears throat> now, the third one being personal trainers. They um, have studied to get a certificate for in health and fitness. Now, there's great variations in these certificate fours. Some can be completed in six weeks and some take up to two years for the whole course of study. Uh, generally, the personal trainer or PT is aimed at delivering fitness programs to low-risk clients without any major illness or injuries um, associated with them, but generally healthy population. Most are recognised by Medicare or in private health funds. However, there are some great PTs with incredible knowledge and they do specialise in particular conditions and areas and they often have many hands-on experience, so don't discount them. Talk to one and see if there's a, a local um, PT that's appropriate for you. Consulting regularly with one or more of these exercise specialists throughout your Parkinson's journey will give you immeasurable benefits. It will improve your quality of life. They will really, really help you. 
For someone with Parkinson's, it's essential. Your exercise and challenge today is to research a convenient physio, exercise physiologists and PT in your area. Our Parkinson's info line can assist you to find someone suitable. These exercises are intended or implied to be a substitute for professional medical advice. Please consult with your own health professional team before engaging in any fitness programs. Type any questions you have into the comments section. If you'd prefer not to write in the comments, please send us a private message through Messenger or call our info line on 1800 644 189. Thanks for watching. Keep well and I'll see you next time.